What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Ron P Media. Shouts out to all my medians for tuning in. And as you can tell by the title, I'm going to show you all the quick and simple way to record your vocals in FL Studio. I mean, it's pretty much the same for all the FL Studios, but I'm using FL Studio 12 right now. But um, it's pretty much the same overall. You know what I'm saying? So let's just jump right into it. And I'm not going to mix and master the vocals, but if y'all want me to make a video on how to, you know, mix your vocals a little bit, make them sound clean and crisp, then I'll make a separate video on that. So this video is just pretty much how to record into FL. Um, also, if you don't have your interface and your microphone installed and all of that, I can make a video on showing you how to do that as well. So this is for people who already got their mics and interfaces installed and just need to know exactly how to record. Um, so let's just jump into it. I got my beat right here. If you want to know how to put your beat in FL Studio, the way that I do it, the simple way, if I have the beat on my desktop, I just grab it and drag it right in there and it'll show up right there. You know what I'm saying? So. All right, so now that you once you drag your beat into the program, what you want to do is go right here to your channel rack, and this is your beat right here. You're gonna click on that. You're gonna you're gonna uh, right left click on that. I'm sorry, left click on that, and I just put it in channel one, and then I name it. Right click, go to rename, and we're gonna call it the beat. Okay, so now your beat is in channel one. You can control the volume of that. Then you go to channel two. This is where I'm going to put my vocals at. So I'm going to put, uh, we're going to call it lead vocal. Okay, so now that my vocal is in this channel, and since it's highlighted, you want to go over here. And you're going to click, and if your mic and your interface is installed, you'll see it right here you know and it'll be one of these so mine is number one so now you see my microphone is on you see channel two is moving hello hello so so now we're just ready to record now so what you do you go to the record button and then I click this microphone and go down to this where it says into playlist as an audio clip some people use Edison, but I don't really use it. So I go to this. This is the simple way for beginners. Um, and you click this, and then you're going to hear it click three times. Click, 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 and then you'll be ready to record. So let's give it a shot. Yo, I came from the bottom. I was whipping for them Jordans. Now I'm whipping in the form. All the girls think I'm gorgeous. All right. So once you're done recording, it's gonna look like this. It's just gonna be one straight line. All you gotta do is go to channel rack again. You remember this was the beat right here? Well, this is the vocal. So you're gonna click on this. You're gonna left click on that, and you're gonna put it in the channel that you recorded in. So y'all remember we put the vocals in track two. So we're gonna put this in track two. Always wanna just raise the volume all the way up, you know that way it sound more fuller when you get ready to mix it and then you go to normalize those are the two things you always want to do raise the vocals and go to normalize okay so we can exit out of this if you see this highlighted and you're done recording just hit that make sure you're not recording no more okay so now this is your vocal you know and it's in track two let me move this out the way it's in track two, so you got the beat and you got the vocals. Yo, I came from the bottom. I was whipping for them Jordans. Now I'm whipping in the form. All the girls think I'm gorgeous. <laughs> so that's it, you know. And if you want to add doubles or uh, ad libs or anything like that, you go to the next track. You title it what you want. Do the same thing. Turn your microphone on and then you know hit record but one thing let me tell you this though this is another thing always make sure before you record in the next track that your microphone is off in the previous track so this was the previous track I recorded in you go back over here you go to none 
because you don't want microphones open at every channel because then you're going to be recording and in every channel it's going to mess up it's going to throw up all it throw off all of your stuff so make sure that your microphone is off in the previous track before you record in the next track if y'all want me to make a video on how to install the interface and your microphone or you want me to make a video on mixing and mastering which I'm probably going to do that anyway um, just comment down below let me know what y'all what y'all want to see you know I'm going to show y'all the simple ways to record your music and use FL Studio so but stay tuned make sure y'all check the description for my email my social medias and all of that stuff make sure y'all please subscribe and like this video so I know I'm doing the right things and yeah keep it 100 peace